deal with the specific specifiers like percentage F, percentage E, and percentage G with float values, and percentage O and percentage X with decimal values. Let's take an example to illustrate the difference between these specifiers. How these specifiers will display the value on the output screen. Suppose if I have a float variable, I say A equals to 351.723. Assume that I have declared a variable A with a number called as 351.723. Now, this number can be displayed using various specifiers. Let me write this variable with all these specifiers. Let me first complete the printf instructions. Now, I'd use these printf instructions. I have written the value of a with various specifiers. Now, let's find the output in all these cases. The first statement says that the value of a need to be displayed with the percentage f specifier. We have discussed that percentage f specifier will always display a fractional number with six fractional digits. Yes, so it means that the value of a is now displayed as 351.723 followed by three additional zeros. Because F specifier or a former specifier percentage F will always use six digits in the fraction part. Since I have a less number of digits, it will add up additional zeros in this. If I could have more digits, then it could have displayed all the digits in that particular value. In that case, the restriction is not for just 6. If you have less, then it is 6. It means that there will be minimum 6 or more than that particular number will display. Now, what percentage E specifier does with this particular A? Percentage E specifier will now align the decimal point, will move the decimal point towards left or towards right. So, but when it aligns, when it does this particular shifting of decimal point, it will always make sure that there is one non-zero number left before the decimal point. In this case, I have example as 351.723. So this particular point need to be moved towards the left hand side by two positions. So I'll get a number as 3.51723. But wait, I have five fractional digits in the fraction part. But rule says that there should be always six of fractional digits since what it does is it will now add up one additional zeros in this. So I have the number as 3.517230. I have shifted this decimal point by two positions since it says E and then it says 2. In some cases with some compilers you might get the output as E plus 2 also. Now why plus 2? Because I have shifted the decimal points towards the left hand side. If I could have shifted the decimal point towards the right hand side, yes, in that case it could have been minus 2. Suppose, assume that I have one more variable c with a value say 0 0.00157. Now, a printf of this instruction, printf percentage e comma c now before we discuss the other parameters let's work with the second example suppose if i have c with a variable as 0 0.00157 so in this case percentage e specifier will move the decimal point which is within c towards the right hand side but how by how many times in this case it will move by three times because there should be always one non-zero number before the decimal point Hence, the number which is displayed is 1.57. But I know that I should have 6 digits, since so I'll have additional 6 fractional digits, followed by E. This time, it will be minus 3. Because I have shifted the decimal point 
towards right hand side by three questions. Now, what G specifier does? G specifier will display the number without any additional zeros. So the number will be displayed as it is. A has got the number as 351.723. What will be the difference between a small e and capital E? As such, small e also displays the number in exponential format. Capital E also displays the number in exponential format. In that case, the only difference is capital E appears on the screen instead of small e. So here it displays A has to be shifted. The number is 3.517230 capital E and 2. So the exponential format will display the number with E format here. E represents base of 10. Now how percentage O and percentage X differs? Now percentage O and percentage X will not work with floating point values. They will work with integer values. Let's try and work with integer values. So assume that I have an integer variable say D. Take a small number. Let me say, say 17. I have a number as 17. Now I can display this decimal number which is stored in D with various specifiers. Let me write printer for this. Now, I have used these numbers. I have used the variable D and wish to display the number with a different specifiers. Let's try the output in all the cases. No, no guess uh, uh, for this particular first printf displays a decimal integer value. Obviously, it will display 17 on the screen. Now, the second specifier displays the octal equivalent of this particular D. How do I get the octal equivalent of this particular D? For that, let's try some mathematics at this place. Now, 17 is the number. What it does is, it internally divides this number by 8. 17 is continuously divided by 8 till I get a quotient less than 8. So, in the first attempt itself, I will say 8 to the 16, remainder is 1. I have got a quotient which is less than 8, hence stop the operation and the digits which are going to be are 2 and 1. Which means that the output which appears on screen is 2, 1. Now, 2, 1 is not stored in a D. D contains what? 17. But on the output screen, you get 2, 1. Which means that 21 is the octal equivalent of what? This particular 17. Percentage X specifier. Percentage X specifier says that you should display the hexadecimal value of D. Now, how to get hexadecimal value? You should take 17 and divide the number by 16. So, 16, 1 the 16, remainder is 1 in this case. So, I'll stop the operation because the quotient which I got is less than 16. Got it right? So, less than 16, stop the operation, collect the numbers, 1, 1. So, on the output screen, I display 1, 1, which means that a X specifier will display the hexadecimal equivalent of the number. So, if the number is 17, D specifier will display 17 because it's the decimal value. O specifier displays 2, 1, which is the octal value. X specifier displays the hexadecimal value, that is 1, 1. So, Percentage F, E and G are with a float with a difference. Percentage O, X and D are with integer with a difference. D for decimal values, O for octal value, X for hexadecimal values. Thank you.